I'm Nick Wilkinson and together with my wife I own Rio Largo Olive Estate. We produce extra virgin olive oil of the highest quality and the other half of production on the farm is wine grapes which we send to a local cooperative. What brought me to making olive oil? Uh, probably health reasons. I fly an aeroplane and have a medical every year and got advised that the high blood pressures and uh, bad cholesterol, perhaps I should change my diet and my lifestyle. So I opted out of 25 years of professional working in the corporate world and decided to try my hand at making olive oil. We had success right out of the starting blocks and I think basically your background as an accountant, you stick to the rules. Uh, if you can't measure something, if you can't control it, and make sure you make the best quality product you can do. Uh, first year out of the starting blocks, we won the double gold at the SA Olive Awards competition, which is, recognizes the best olive oil produced in the country each year. And from there on, it's just been a great success story. We won awards across the world, from California to New York, to Japan, to the Middle East, to Europe. And it's something that's done my lifestyle one hell of a lot of good, and I've enjoyed every minute of it. There's a bit of attention to detail, and as I said, as an accountant, you stick to the rules. If it says do steps 1 to 10, I do steps 1 to 10. And make sure you follow that discipline with a hands-on approach. You know, success is bound to happen. The CASA designation, how has that helped me? Well, I think you've got to go back to the real beginning of doing your articles. It was pretty tedious, hard work, uh, not the most exciting, but it taught you the basics of business from every perspective, be it human resources, finance, accounting, marketing, you had some sort of uh, insight into how big business worked. And it taught you the very fundamentals, which I think if you put in practice, you can do anything you want to do. Uh, if you have an entrepreneurial flair, you'll certainly use that background. If you want to go into uh, corporate business, you have the wherewithal to do that. And nobody can take that experience away from you. The very basis, of, the essence of it, is serving those articles and obviously passing the theory of all your exams. Success is not a, doesn't come overnight. It takes plenty of hours. You know, 10,000 hours of experience is maybe going to get you somewhere. So stick with it and be in it for the long run and understand why you're doing it and keep motivated.